very important because it's not just only a form of uh, exercise it's also a form of socialization and uh, also a form of uh, entertainment you know especially during this time when we are still in a pandemic we need this kind of entertainment when especially during this time when uh, it's now more open for us to go out uh, so it gives us a chance to really be together again in the community and like before where we had to stay in our houses right because of the pandemic so this ballroom dancing is a chance for us to socialize, meet new friends, have fun. And also, you know, get some exercise, which is very important. Hi everyone! So the next person that we're going to be interviewing is none other than the current president of the Filipino-American community of Los Angeles, the woman in action, Trinity Foliente. The role of the event is I'm the acting president of ACLA. And you know, my first, first, first uh, customer here is the start of the night. You know, they really made Takla great because of this, because of this event. Um, tell me a little bit about um, the significance of ballroom dancing in our community for, for Filipinos, Filipino Americans. How important is this uh, ballroom dancing for? It's re yeah. It's really, you know, it's really good for, you know, actually, the dancing is good for everybody. The ball, especially the ballroom dancing. The, ball, uh, the ballroom dancing creates all these activities here, you know, as a Filipino American, because of, you know, it's uh, because of health, health fitness. Is, uh, I'm really for that, you know. You know, uh, actually, this is my fifth year as far as I could recall. And before I was nothing, I don't know how to cha-cha, I don't know, I don't know when to boogie. And then once I get used into that, it's really into my system already. Like, you know, I'm a teacher since 2001 here in LA. And then it's just like, you know, to a distress, to keep my sanity. Once I'm dancing, it's just like I'm flying, I'm floating. That makes me really, you know, get into dancing.
for almost like 30 years and this is my partner Francis Hi, Tabacan Francis, yeah. and, and uh, to answer the question we've been dancing approximately like around 16 years now from 2005 up to now what's your guys favorite dance salsa and, yeah, more and salsa and uh, latin dance latin dance and uh, Argentine Django is one of her passionate things. showcases. And your name? My name is Tom Hicks. I've been dancing for, for probably about 50 years. I started very young. I don't know how that can be when I'm only about 36 right now, <laughs> but it has been about 50 years. Uh, I was a U.S. Uh, uh, champion back in the early 90s, representing the United States throughout the world, in Russia, in China, in Norway, England. England all I over the that. place so i've been doing it enjoy it and i love it and i love dancing here with my lad. we love dancing at fat club it's a great place <laughs> to come out and dance and enjoy all the company and all the people <laughs>
Los Angeles Fire Department with the Admin Services Bureau wow. as a fiscal system specialist. Too. So how long you been working in the, is that a federal or state? It's a city, city, city of Los Angeles. Okay, so how long you been working in there? Oh my gosh, uh, 25, 26 years. Wow, so it's a very promising retirement, diba? Right? Yes. <laughs> Maybe that's the reason why you also stick with it. So, but anyway, gano na po kayo katagal nagsasayaw? Oh, we started dancing ballroom January 2012. Oh God, I've been dancing since I was a kid. But in America, I've been dancing since 1990s. What got you started? What got you started in dancing? What inspired you I've to dance? I've always been dancing as a kid. I was in a dance troupe in the Philippines in my school. Then being in uh, with the parents. I was born to a parents of politicians. So I was always in parties. So I grew up being in parties all the time. What was your favorite dance back then? You know, when I was, this was so many, many years ago. Uh, the early, the early stages of dancing for me was like uh, cha cha, tango, all those, all the Latin dances, dances. But then I kind of like grew, and then got much better since I arrived in America because I've been dancing regularly. Next one. We have the famous Kiss Seventy-four. You are seventy-four. Yes, I just wow. turned seventy-four. Thank you. That's amazing. Yes. Anyway, um, so anong pinag so you retired now, right? Yes. Anong pinagkakabalhan mo ngayon aside from I know you're a dancer. Yes, I own seven facilities. Seven. Seven adult and elderly facilities. So, I'm Luz Alacar and my uh, dance partner Benico. And how long you been in dancing? Uh, quite a few years, but seriously, uh, last five years. Okay, tell us about your partner. My partner, we just started dancing since March. Yeah, so, yeah. I've, I've heard that he's been a comp uh, uh, competitor in the Philippines and that, also in Asia. That's correct. So, yeah, I can see him dancing in the uh, in any event, and he was really great. And you were very spontaneous also in the dance floor, so how can you compare other dancers to him? Well, they have different styles, but uh, I would say that he has helped me a lot more than How was your chemistry with other dancers? Uh, not the same. You get, uh, how would I say that? When you came better, yeah. better with some yes. because of chemistry and, you know, and... Uh, I think most of What is your favorite dance with Latin. him or as a performer? Latin. Latin dance. Latin. Yes. Uh, what particular in Latin? Rumba, cha cha. Rumba, cha cha. So, which of those are most favorite? Rumba. Rumba. Why rumba? I don't know. It's. Because it's the mother of all dances. Diba? It's sexy. It's very sensual. <laughs>
receive a special lifetime award for this evening. To be presented to us by Consulate General Ed Badajos and Janet Cruz. Salsa, cumbia, um, bachata. <coughs> what, what do you like about it compared to the other dances? I like fast dancing. I like it lively and more on the beat, I think. Oh, I've been dancing for I, about 18 years. 18 years? Mm -hmm. What did you start it? I'm sorry? What got you started? What um, did you I do? love dancing and my husband, my husband, my son is a DJ. So I, that's motivated me to start the, my own studio. Oh, you have your uh, own I have my own studio. Own studio. Uh, it's dance time in Carson, in the city of Carson. Okay. What's your favorite dance? Tango. Tango? <laughs> Why Tango? I don't know. When I was young, my uncle used to dance with me, you know, in front of our, of our store in the Philippines when I was still young. Yeah, oh, okay. Uh, what's the difference with Tango and the other dances? What's the difference? Well, it's more passionate. <laughs> This is what I'm supposed to do because I've been talking to a lot of film on my events already. So instead of giving a speech, why don't I just serenade the ladies? Sure! Yeah, it's just yeah. like wow! <laughs> See, we have an example of delivering speeches to. Huh? Uh, Ikao. Ikao! Yeah. Please come closer, yeah? Okay, adjust to adjust. <laughs>